Newsflash, no one cares about parabolas, which is why half the class is playing Angry Birds under their desk. But since you don't have a smartphone yet, you have to resort to a more noble and outdated form of boredom relief. That is, doodling. And you've invented a game of your own, a doodle game, that connects the dots in ways your math curriculum never will. Say you hate history, can't do names or dates. To you the past some mystery, rather chill with your mates. Yet boys can name the England squad, the girls know Katie Price. You all remember lyrics, your memory will suffice. So if you need rhyming to help you pass the test, I'll rap the history for you, guarantee you some success. My name's Nicholas II, I'm the Romanov Tsar. Empire's huge, it spreads wide and far. Be chosen by God, divine right of kings. The power, the glory, plenty of bling. It's 1914. Has grown. Check it out. I inherited them brain kids. The Saxons fell on their knees. I took over their kingdom so Christians they could become Milan and Lombardy, Venice and Saxony, Barcelona and Burgundy. Of course, there's Rome and then Gascony. Then in a double zero, I was crowned by Pope Leo. Not something that I did prefer, but now I'm Holy Roman Emperor. Eventually, everyone's gonna realize that it's beneficial to share ideas. O compartilhamento é a própria natureza da criação. There's no way to kill this technology. We can only criminalize its use. book, Steal Like an Artist. It's a list of 10 things I wish I'd heard when I was just starting out. The big idea of the book is that you are a mashup of what you let into your life, and anyone can be creative if they surround themselves with the right influences, play nice, and work hard. Creativity is not magic. Creativity is for everyone. Well, almost everyone.